Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. I'm Assassin Ghost and today we are going to see how to create sub menus, hamburger menu in Adobe Muse CC 2018. So if you haven't watched my previous video, which is on how to create a hamburger menu only using the top level pages, then be sure to watch it because um, after that you will get a quite a good idea how to create this. So basically we are going to create a accordion hamburger menu with sub menus not only the top level do top level pages so a guy named Marcus Vinicius uh, I don't know if I'm pronunciating it correct uh, if I'm not please let me know in comment he asked about sub menus on my previous video so here we are first of all I'm going to start news I'm going to create a new site I will leave every default settings and I'll press OK. Now I'm going to create a page. If I can spell it right, page. Then another page. And now this page will have a sub page. Let's call it sub. And maybe another sub. Okay, so we have this structure right here. We have a home page and two pages. These pages have two sub pages. And now we're going to A master. And we are going to this widgets library. And I'm going to go in the menus and I'll drag a horizontal menu for the desktop so we have this horizontal menu for the desktop I'll go and click on this blue circle and I'll say menu type all pages and now we'll have the sub pages and if I want to resize it, I can resize it like this. And I will make it a little bit more bigger. And now at this point, if I preview it, by going to File and selecting Preview Page in Browser or by directly pressing Control or Command, Shift and E. So now we have this desktop menu and we have home page, our page and two sub pages. So it's okay for desktop, it's so easy. But for creating it a mobile friendly hamburger menu, then we need to uh, first create a breakpoint right here. I'll just go to the breakpoint bar and I'll right click on it and say add breakpoint and I will add a mobile breakpoint 320 and I'll press OK. Now we are just going to hide this menu in the mobile site. So I will just select it and right click on it and say hide in this breakpoint. And I'll go to the menus and this time I'll drag a vertical menu. So if our website only contains the top level pages then it's quite easy we can easily make it using the accordion accordion panel but just for instance you can see that I will click on this blue icon and I will say menu type all pages then you will see the sub pages are like this and if I want it to be visible or my mobile breakpoint then I'll have to go here I'll select the menu and I'll have to resize it like this and then if someone clicks on it they will see it so it's not quite good and we want to make it as accordion so I'm just going to delete this I'll select the menu and press delete and this time we have to create a vertical menu but uh, I will click on this blue icon and I'll go to menu type and I'll say manual we are growing we are going to create all the pages manually 
So I'll just go and type home. And now I'll add another. I'll type page now I'll have to create sub pages down of my page for example we have the sub pages inside this page so I will create the sub page right here sub and again sub 2 I think we are going right it's sub 1 okay page sub sub 1 and page 2 so I'll go here and I'll rename it sub 1 and now we'll go to the page 2 actually it's creating the sub menu so we need to get to the if you click on the sub and create a, a new page it will create a sub and the auto number for example we had the sub 1 then it will create sub 2 sub 3 and so on so just click on it and we want to change it just keep on clicking until you get your text tool and then type the name of the page you want so now we have our menu we need to link it so that when someone click on home they reach home so we'll first of all we'll select the our menu item and then we'll go to home and then here we will go to this hyperlink and I'm going to link it to the home and now same thing I'll go to page I'll link it with page and again I'll go to sub and I'll link it to page sub then again I'll go to sub 1 and I'll link it to sub 1 and then I'll go to page 2 and I'll link it to page 2 and after that as you all know we'll just go and drag an accordion panel and I'll right click on it and I'll say clear widget contents clear all styling I'll create the hamburger icon fill it with something like blue or any color you want I'll press option or alt key and I'll drag it to make a copy of it then I'll again make a copy of it by doing the same thing that is basically uh, pressing the alt key and then dragging it and then I will select this three and I'll just group it uh, where can I find the group yeah right here group and I'll make sure it's behind the accordion panel so I will go to the layers I'll go in layer and as you can see this group is above the accordion panel so I'll just drag it down to make it accordion or also I can do this we have this group that is the hamburger icon above the accordion menu so I will just click on this group I will select it and then I'll right click on it and say arrange and then send to backward or back so I'll just send it back it will go to the very back that's what we want but if you want just to uh, make it go one step back then we'll say go backward so now we have this hamburger icon so I'll just go and drag this label right here And I'm just going to resize it and I'll just take this menu and I'll put it inside here 
and I'm going to resize it okay too much okay yeah so I will just go to home and maybe color it a little bit like this and now I'll select the accordion and I'll go to this blue circle and I'll say can close all because if you don't tick it then they won't be able to close it and if you want this menu to overlap anything uh, down it then you can select the accordion and say overlap items below so I'm just going to collapse it and before previewing it I'll just select everything on this breakpoint and I'll say hide in other breakpoints now I'll go to file preview page in browser and we have this desktop page and for the mobile menu we have this nice home page sub and sub one the only reason why we are creating it manually is because uh, if you drag a menu from the widgets library just like this then you can't edit or move the uh, individual items for example if I just want to move this page then I can't move it even if I click too much or select anything then I won't be able to move it I'll have to move it all together so we need to create it manually and I can't delete individual items I'll have to just go ahead and delete everything So this is how you create an accordion hamburger menu in Adobe Muse with the sub menus. So if you like this video please leave a like and also subscribe to my channel and if you want any other tutorial be sure to comment it down below. I'll make sure to do it as soon as possible and also I upload videos regularly so definitely subscribe to my channel that really helps me and as always thanks for watching.